Welcome to the final weigh-in for Claire. My name is Jodie Bunting and this is a free six-week course where our slimmers are trying to lose a stone in six weeks. Claire, you've had your final yeah. weigh-in. What's the news? Um, I've stayed the same. <laughs> You're the queen of maintaining is what you said I to am. the message earlier. I am. <laughs> However, your total weight loss is nine and a half pounds. Yes. Which is amazing, isn't it? So well done it for is. that. Thank you. Now, I did challenge my slimmers yesterday uh, to check their back gardens for my Easter egg challenge. Have you done that? Yes. Did you find anything? No. You are the worst Easter egg hunter ever. So what, what I want you to do, Claire, is to go next to your bins in that, what's that pop-up thing with the lid? What do you call oh, it? Right. So if you can go in there, I was quite worried that Daisy was going to find them before you. Well, she wouldn't go in the bin, would she? I know, but I thought she might sniff them out. It's not in the bin, it's the thing next to the bins. And there's a black bag there. Good job you didn't put it in the bin because the <laughs> bin man came today. <laughs> That's what I thought. I did think it, I was trying to remember when he came. Can you see the black bag in there? Yeah. Oh, this is exciting. <laughs> I, did, I went out last night when I saw the message. I um, It was dark when I saw it, but I thought, oh, I'll go and have a route round the garden. But I didn't find anything. <laughs> Oh, so yeah, there is a gift. There's two gifts for you in there. There's also a gift for our lovely friend Catherine in there. Oh, bless you. So Thank if you. If you want to show them the camera, what you've got. Oh, hang on. I'm excited. I've got to learn how to turn that round. Hang on. Yeah, not so exciting delivered in a black bin liner. I love the way Daisy's excited. <laughs> Oh, uh, that was be for Catherine. Oh, yes. There's Catherine's orange <laughs> twirl egg. If it survives. <laughs> oh. There is your vegan Ooh. raspberry. That sounds nice. And then you also have another one. Oh, tangy orange. The vegan orange one. There we go. Lovely. I it's probably a good job I um, didn't find them the other night. <laughs> I did say to Catherine tonight, do you think she's found them, eat them both, and she'll say she, she could never find them, because she's, <laughs> she's eaten the non-vegan one as well. Well, I've done quite well in the office, because at one point, Last week, we had 150 Easter eggs in the office. <laughs> but for anybody who doesn't know, Claire does work for me and D Charity. So this is yeah, why. It's work for me. <laughs> <laughs> and I have delivered about 100 to Derby Children's Hospital today. Oh, great. So, yeah. That's good. So I really it wanted to good. give you that vegan treat, Claire, just because I know the last Thank six you. weeks has been hard. And you haven't given up, which I think is the, the biggest thing. As you know, with a lot of my course members, if anything happens, they kind of give up. They'll say they'll try again, but they never kind of do. But you have stuck at it and you've yeah. kept that weight loss off right from the beginning. So, yeah, yeah, I'm glad, I'm really, glad I've kept it off. This is why I really think you deserved a treat. So well done. Thank you. And I'm even more happy oh. at my hiding skills, the fact that you didn't find them. Yeah, I am, yeah. I didn't, I didn't even think to look in there. I say I walked around the garden while Daisy was out last night, but I didn't see anything. And I thought Daisy would have told me if she'd seen you. So. I was well, I was quite scared when I knew that Daisy was going to be in there. I really liked <laughs> in my bunny outfit, I crept really slowly. <laughs> And for those of you that don't know, Claire also has a dog walker. And I was just really worried in case she was there and she saw me in my bunny outfit as well. Oh, can you imagine? <laughs> <laughs> right. 
So yes, Happy. that was my little gift for you. Um, Thank you. Let's just talk briefly about the course. What was your highlight of the course, the easiest bit? I think actually having you stay. <laughs> <laughs> that was probably uh, in some ways the, the easiest bit because you there was somebody there I was supposed to eat with me as much as anything um yeah. and just yeah just a bit of company and yeah that was quite nice but you, I suppose it was quite nice knowing you was also going away again <laughs> in the nicest possible way <laughs> but you see, yeah I know eating out of the, the out of the ordinary not feeling normal is a bad thing isn't it so just being able to enjoy something healthy with someone is a, a yeah. plus so yeah you're right about that and what was the most challenging thing of the last six weeks probably also the week that you that's were there what, that's why I was laughing because <laughs> like it was also the worst bit as well yeah, yeah probably <laughs> And but, what, uh, what have you learned from the last six weeks that you're going to be able to take forwards? Um, that I love avocado chips. They are definitely a favourite. And I'm having them for tea tonight with some vegan sausages. And what are you cooking your avocado chips in? Uh, coconut what? oil. Perfect. And just that combination is so tasty, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Right, what is your goal from here and when do you want to achieve it by? Oh, goodness. Um, I need to start moving more to try and start losing again. I'm very good at staying the same weight, but I need to shift a bit more yet. Um, so I need to start hopefully getting Daisy to walk a bit more again. Um because she's been a pain but I also need to just get running again um I wasn't fit enough when I did the 10k on Sunday so I want to build that up again we forgot to mention that well done for that as well thanks yeah so, I know but going from not really running at all to doing a part run a couple of weeks ago to then doing a 10k many people would think that's an achievement you definitely shouldn't know. Think about it i know but i think because i know what i was able to do yeah um, past. blooming covid has knocked me completely back so um in some respects i was frustrated with my time on sunday but then in other ways i did better than i thought i was gonna do so yeah, all in all. Uh, four of our slimmers were meant to be doing the uh, 10K and only two of you managed to do it. So the fact that you just um, achieved it and got the medal is an achievement yeah. in my eyes. <laughs> yeah, I was always going to do it one way or another, whether I walked it all or, or not. But um, I know I could have done it better. Yeah. So. Fab. Right. Anything else? you'd like to say thank you no thank you it's been an absolute <laughs> pleasure uh, and I just feel really awkward now that I didn't get the dog easter egg for Daisy oh don't worry about it she doesn't deserve it <laughs> yeah, because she won't walk in the morning then she doesn't deserve it you're right no no I tried to walk her tonight and she wouldn't go so I bunged her in the car and went to the park instead and she walked for mine it's just getting her off the driveway Oh, great. Right. Well, thank you very much, Claire. No, thank you. Happy Have Easter. Have a lovely holiday. Thank you very much. Looks Enjoy awful. Easter. Bye. <laughs> Bye. See ya.